Uh, folks, I'm excited to be on the call with you this evening. As always, it's a phenomenal time to be a part of Exceed Health and where we're going and how we're growing, folks. It's just absolutely incredible. Um, before we get started in the call, I wanted to do just some real quick housekeeping. Um, we have a competition uh, that is going for those of you who may or may not know. Uh, we have a competition where the uh, winner of the competition has the ability to actually win a Fiat, an Exceed wrapped and branded Fiat. Um, and so that's something that's going on right now. It's a major competition that is heating up uh, right and left in, in our company. Um, the, I'm going to give you a couple of names here that are in the top 10 positions right now, uh, positioning themselves to win this fiat in the competition. Winner gets all Keith title license and the bragging rights of having won the fiat. So we've got uh, Matt and Dino, we've got Gianna, we've got Gabe, we've got Brett. Uh, those are all within our top four positions, five positions, and we've got Kim Hawk and Susan Bona, we've got Victoria Giannis, so we've got Vincent Perry, Lena Cormick, Jeff, and Stars and Stripes folks. Those are the people that are in the top ten running for the Drive and Thrive competition that we've got for the Fiat. Uh, so, folks, welcome to the call out tonight. We're going to do what we normally do. Folks, for those of you who it's the first time that is, you've been on one of my calls, I do things a little bit different. This is not your typical network marketing opportunity meeting or presentation call. We don't get into a lot of nitty-gritty facts, Egyptian hieroglyphics, or any of the other funny stuff that a lot of people do. You're not going to hear me say that this is so ground floor that it's the basement of the basement, or that our products are the best thing since sliced bread or, uh, you know, that we're so new that our, our products aren't branded or, you know, whatever it is that people say is gimmicks to get you to join network marketing companies that you've heard in the past. I'm also not going to go into long, drawn-out equations and algorithms and different things like that to explain the compensation model. <coughs> I also promise, sorry about that, I had a little cough there, bug in my throat. I also promise that uh, we're not going to do a long 45-minute presentation unless you ask me to. I don't believe in long calls. I believe in calls that are short, sweet, to the point, and get you the information that you need to be able to make a decision that is best for you. Now, that being said, I'm also going to be a little bit honest with you. I like to tell stories. Um, I like to explain things in stories because stories are powerful. And, you know, the reality here is the fact that you're on this call tonight, and I don't know the exact reason why, you know, I'm not going to proclaim to know, you know, why you're here, you know, whether it's, you know, to buy a new car or to pay off debts or to purchase a new house or to be able to afford your rent payment next month or buy food or buy clothes for the kids or put in my money for retirement or maybe the financials isn't what's bugging you, maybe it's health, maybe you want to lose some weight or you want to get more energy, or you want to be able to bend over and pick up your kids, or, or tie your shoes, or not be winded when you're walking upstairs, or you want to get some joint pain to go away, or different things like that. And you know, maybe physical isn't it for you. Maybe it's relationships. Maybe you're looking for more time with your wife and kids, or more time to go on vacation. Maybe you want to travel and experience world cultures. And maybe that's not even it for you. Maybe you're just looking for the chance to step into a greater measure of your purpose and become the type of person you were looking to become so that you can donate to, to church and charity the way you want to donate to church and charity and you can want to give and serve mankind. I don't know what it is for you why you're here, but the fact is you're here and the reason that you're here is because you're in a position where you're ready to change and you're looking for a vehicle that can help you achieve whatever it is that is your main reason for being here. The fact that you're listening to my voice right now just means that you're in a position where you're ready to find that thing or that vehicle that is greater than the sum of its parts that is positioned well to give people a chance to be where they want to be and do and have more and be more and give more in their life. So folks, that's why we're here tonight. Uh, I tend to do things a little bit differently, as you'll see. I apologize for how quickly I speak. Normal people, people speak at, uh, you know, under 200 words a minute. I typically tend to speak at, you know, 250, 300, with gusts, gusts up to 450 to 500. So it's just who I am. I'm energized. I have a lot of energy. I believe in what we do. So uh, you'll have to just forgive me. I talk very, very quickly. Now, that being said, I want to talk to you about a story that I ran across the other day which impacts me very much. I, I love our military. I love our soldiers. Um, you know, whether we agree with war or fighting or anything else, I do believe that our soldiers have made very selfless decisions for their lives in front of our uh, liberty to defend us. And that's something that's very important to me. It's very important to my family. I have family members that are in the military as well. And so when I saw this story today, it touched my heart. 
Uh, it touched me in a profound way. There was an eight-year-old boy, imagine his surprise, when he goes out to, to, to uh, a meal with his family. And he goes out to the meal and they get to the local Cracker Barrel restaurant. And he's walking towards the door, he's getting in the parking lot, and in the parking lot he finds a $20 bill. Now a $20 bill to an eight-year-old kid is a whole, whole bunch of money. And so he was automatically thinking of all the different toys that he could buy and different things he could buy inside the, the, the Cracker Barrel with this $20. Maybe even buy a video game uh, and, you know, all these different things. Now, here's the problem. This young little boy named Miles, he changed his mind. See, he went into the Cracker Barrel and, and he saw a soldier, Lieutenant Colonel Frank Daly, he saw a soldier in his uniform, and the child ended up deciding to give the soldier the money along with the thank you note. Now, there's a reason behind this, but before we get to that reason, I want to tell you what the note read. So this soldier now looks at this note every single day. Every single day. Now think about this for a second. As the note reads, Dear soldier, my dad was a soldier. He's in heaven now. I found this $20 in the parking lot when we got here. We like to pay it forward in my family. It's your lucky day. Thank you for your service, Miles Eckert, a Gold Star Kid. Just think about that for a second. Here's an eight-year-old kid who found himself in a position where he had some extra money. He had extra. And he could have just bought himself something, bought himself a toy, bought himself a video game, bought himself candy. Yet he saw something. He saw somebody in that restaurant that he knew would be deserving of this. So he gave him a, a letter. My dad was a soldier. He's in heaven now. I found this $20 in the parking lot when we got here. I'd like to pay it forward in my family. We like to pay it forward in my family. It's your lucky day. Thank you for your service. You see, folks, in life, we all get put in positions where we have opportunities. And, you know, a lot of people, when they talk about network marketing, they talk about opportunities. They talk about business, and they talk about freedom. And mostly when they're talking about freedom, they're talking about financial. And they're talking about owning cars and owning yachts and being able to fly in private planes and being able to make a quarter of a million dollars in a week and being able to wear a $50,000 watch or a $30,000 suit or a $5,000 pair of shoes. And they're talking about all these different things that are material, 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 material. Now, there's nothing wrong with abundance folks, don't get me wrong. But however, that's the main focus. You see, I used to watch this happen in the industry all the time. I've been in this industry for about 17 years now. I've been designing compensation plans for seven. And I've been designing compensation plans for seven years because I found things that were happening within this industry that I didn't like anymore. I did not like the direction that the industry was going. I found entitlement creeping up on the industry. I found false senses of security and false senses of success as compensation plans were designed to deceive people into thinking that they were closer to making it than they really were. So I decided to make some changes. I decided to make some compensation plans. The problem was I didn't have enough decision power. I wrote seven compensation plans for seven companies. I helped four companies launch from scratch, including three companies that transitioned from traditional marketing into network marketing. And then last year, I was contacted by John DeVries and Cody Highsmith through a mutual friend, and they asked me to put together a compensation plan. Now, folks, I'm picky. I don't work with just anybody. I'm very picky at who I choose, and the reason why is I've got a limited amount, a finite amount of time. I have a wife, I have five lovely children, they're beautiful, they're the reason for everything I do. And and I sat down and I took a look at them, and I took a look seriously, and there's certain things I look for in a successful company to determine whether or not I'll do a consulting agreement with them. And one of those things is funding. I want to see if the company is well funded. So I took a look at where they're at funding, and I realized that they were very well funded, that they they invested a, a quite a large sum of money into their into their company. I also noticed that they had a 30,000 square foot building directly across the street from the Las Vegas airport on prime real estate. That's something that most network marketing companies don't come into until three years into business, five years into business. So again, a commitment to excellence on location, commitment to excellence on funding, meaning that they believed in their company, they believed in what they were going to achieve. Then, then we took into consideration their products. 
and their products were very high quality ingredients, very good tasting, very good for you, and did exactly what they say that they're supposed to do. And I was a little concerned at first because the products are a little bit more costly to make than some of the other companies out there. And I asked them, I said, are you sure that you want to use these ingredients because your, your product is a little bit more uh, expensive than, than other products out there? Not necessarily what they're selling it for, but, but what it costs to make is a little bit more expensive. And they said, no, absolutely, we're not going to back down on it. These are the, the ingredients that our doctors have said we needed to have. So these are the ingredients we're going to have. So I saw the commitment in, to excellence in the product. He wasn't going to put, John John uh, John DeVries was not going to put his name on something that was subpar quality. Neither were the doctors. Then I took a look at the doctors themselves, and you know most network marketing companies don't know that if you know this or maybe you might. Um, you most network marketing companies have doctors, but they pay these doctors for their opinion. They pay them a salary to come on board and be the in-house you know doctor counsel that talks about the product and different things. And I looked at our the doctors of X and I looked uh, and looked and saw that they were different that not only did they believe in the products, that they formulate the products, but they actually had significant financial interest in the, in the game themselves, being investors into the company. So not only were they not receiving a check from the company, but they had invested money into the company. And so I saw a commitment of excellence there. And then I saw how they put together their executive team. And they have John DeVries and Cody Highsmith running the, the executive team. And they've got a branding and marketing department that is, is, is phenomenal, producing very, very sexy branding for everything that we do. Then I looked at who they've got for their CFO and Brian Cantor and his ability and, and his expertise in the retail markets throughout the years and, and what he's done in, in the finance world is, is, is helping us leaps and bounds on a daily basis to make sure that we're on track to hitting our financial goals. We've got an IT uh, department that comes in to make sure our computers are running. We've got a guy who repairs the building, anything that goes wrong. We've got our customer service department. We've got a receptionist. We've got everything in place. And I looked and I saw commitment to excellence for the corporate staff. And I looked at what else they had to put together, and they had to put together the, the pay hub. And I looked at that they put together the, the uh, not, not only the pay hub, but they put together a marketing website for people. And they put together their legal firm, which is one of the most prestigious legal ML, MLM firms. And I looked, and yet again, it was another commitment to excellence. And so then we started talking compensation plan because I was interested in working with them at that point because I'd seen that they had the ingredients necessary for a successful venture, a successful network marketing company. So we began talking and, and we began talking about the things that are wrong in the industry. We began talking about the things that have created the entitlement. We began talking about the things that have created the false sense of security, the false sense of success, the false sense of rank, of, of ranks being achieved when they're not really being achieved. And so we talked about it, and we decided to focus on three main areas in the compensation. Number one, now money. We put together a phenomenal retail sales program where you can make excellent and decent retail commissions over the long-term life value of a customer. We put together a jumpstart commission program, which is a three-tier commission that helps you not only make money when you enroll someone, but helps you make money when you help your people enroll people. Uh, on top of that, we have a, a binary commission system that pays out on a weekly basis. Now. On, on the now money, that's all fine and good, but we also wanted to focus on the walkaway money, the residuals, the money that you do the work one time for and get paid over and over and over and over again. So we installed a unilevel crossover. So not only does our compound have a binary, but it also has a unilevel working at the same exact time. So a unilevel compensation structure with a check match structure, with a doubler commission, the stabilizer commission, with all of these different things on a monthly basis to help people get to a walkaway income. Why walk away? So that you can achieve more, have more, do more, be more, and be able to walk away from whatever it is in this moment that's stopping you from living the life of your dreams and going out and achieving the things that you want to achieve. So you can walk away from those things and become that greater person and step into a greater measure of your purpose. So I saw commitment to excellence in the compensation system and what they wanted to do. So we developed the compensation plan and I came on full time for the first time as, as a full time part of the corporate team in, in the network marketing company because they had a commitment to excellence in everything they did. So folks, again, I say I don't know why you're on the phone tonight. I'm not going to assume that you're here for finances. I'm not going to assume that you're here to win a car. I'm not going to assume that you're here to lose weight. I'm not going to assume that you're here for any reason, but I do know that the fact that you're still listening to the sound of my voice means that you are here for a reason. 
and there are no mistakes, there are no coincidences. You are here for a reason, and it may just may be that you're ready to take action and you're ready to make a decision to be more, to have more, to do more, to give more. Now back to the story about this little kid and why it touched my heart so much. This little eight-year-old kid, his father was named Sergeant Andy Eckert. His father was killed in Iraq five weeks after Miles was born. He never knew his father. But he says he imagines him as a nice person. So this little boy finds $20 in the parking lot, and instead of buying candy or soda or a video game or a game or a toy, he sees a soldier and hands it to him with a note. Dear soldier, my dad was a soldier. He's in heaven now. I found this $20 in the parking lot when we got here. We like to pay it forward in my family. It's your lucky day. Thank you for your service. Miles Eckert, a gold star kid. After the family left the Cracker Barrel that day, Miles told his mom he wanted to go see his dad. And so she took him to the cemetery. And when they got here, he said, actually, I'd like to go by myself. And she sat there in the car as you follow and took a picture. And in the picture, as you follow the little, little teeny tiny footsteps through the snow all the way up to the, the, the gravestone of his father, you see a young boy talking excitedly to a tombstone. Nearby his father lay and laid down his life in service for his country and freedom telling his dad all about the fact that he'd been able to pay it forward. Now, folks, I don't know about you, but, you know, I could tell you all day long about the excellence and commitment to excellence that this company strives for. I can tell you about the 30,000 square foot office building, which I have. I can tell you about the product, the phenomenal taste, the fact that they do what they say they're going to do, and they have high-quality ingredients. I could tell you about the executive corporate team. I could tell you about the funding. I could tell you about the doctors. I could tell you about the compensation plan. But not one bit of that matters at all. What really matters is its ability to help you get what you want in your life. See, at Exceed, we believe that we are life. What does that really mean? Well, I don't know what life means to you. Does it mean more time with your family? Does it mean as a single mother being able to have more time with your kids? Does it mean being a father and being able to come home from a third job, a second job, or your first job to spend more time with your friends, family, and, and loved ones? Does it mean being able to pay off your bills so that you can afford to breathe a little bit in peace? Does it mean being able to buy a new house, buy a new car, put money away from retirement? Does it mean to put money away from your kids for your kids' education funds? Does it mean to be able to serve and give and love and laugh and learn what you were meant to learn so that you could rise up to take a, a greater measure of the, the person that you were meant to be, the purpose that you were meant to live, so that later down the road you can take a look back at your life and realize that you have no regrets because you became the person you were meant to become. Whatever it is for you, that's what we're all about. That's what we are life stands for. We are for any of the above and all of the above that you desire for yourself in your heart with true intent and purpose. Come along the ride for, with us. Come and be more. Have more. Do more. Give more. Serve more. Come join us on this trip. Folks, we're at the, the cusp of a mighty wave of momentum. It's coming. Now, I don't do much surfing. I'm afraid of sharks. I'll just be flat out honest. But I do know this much about surfing. It's much better to be ahead of the wave than behind it. Now, with that being said, I'm going to give you four steps that you need to take to join the team. And I know some of you, your credit card's already levitating out of your back pocket, and you're ready to join the team. That's fine. Calm down. It can wait for a second. I'm going to get you started the correct way because our goal is to help you make money so that you can actually step into that greater measure of purpose. So here's the four steps that you need to do. Number one, first and foremost, immediately get in contact with the person who invited you to this call and get their website so that you can click get started and enter in your information. Okay. Now before step two, pull out that credit card and have it ready. Okay. Step, step two, you're going to choose a jump start package. 
Now there's four to choose from. I always recommend the big league pack. No, it's not because it's the biggest pack. The reason why I recommend the big league pack is simply for this. It gives you one of every single one of our phenomenal line of products so that you can have a tangible experience with the product. That way when somebody asks you, hey, what's this fresh stuff? Um, what does the chocolate roca uh, infused meal replacement shake taste like? You'll actually know because you'll have the products and you'll have tasted them. So that's something that I personally believe in. I believe that if you're going to move a product, sell a product, promote a product, you need to be a product of the product. So step step two, choose your Jumpstart pack. Step three, choose an auto ship. Now, auto ship, what this means is all every single one of our products are designed for a 28-day usage, 28 serving. Okay? Uh, our auto ship is also designed to hit every 28 days. Now, why we do this is because we're not merely talking here at Exceed about a 30-day, 60-day, 90-day challenge. We're not here to try to see who can lose the most weight in 30 days, only to go put it on over, put it on back on again over the next, you know, 90 to 120 days. This is about a lifestyle change. This is about using products in conjunction with healthy living, exercise, and better decisions to live a better life so that you can go out and be the person you're meant to be. So it's it's best choose the auto ship products that you would like to use on a daily on a on a 28 day cycle so that we can get those out to you without fail every 28 days so you never run out of product. Okay, that's that's number three. Step number three: choose your auto ship order. And then step number four: once you're finally done and you finalize the enrollment process. Step number four, you're going to go and get from either from your back office or from the person who invited you onto this call a copy of the PDF file that we created to help people conduct their first tasting experience. Tasting experiences, folks, are how people are building their business right now. It's not a traditional business opportunity webinar or meeting. Uh, what we do is we get together with friends, we're talking, we're laughing, we listen to music, we're having fun, and we tell them a little bit about the products and what they've done for us in our lives. We get out our shakers, bring out the product, and start giving people samples, hand out some order forms, and those people who like the products and would love to uh, order them, they start ordering them. Those that don't, at least they've had a good product. They've maybe got some greens that they might have needed in their life. And uh, you know, we, we continue the party and have fun. This is the way that most people are making money with, with our company right now. The, the biggest, fastest money that's being made is being made through this. And I can tell you folks right off the bat, this is back to grassroots marketing. This is back to the principles that have created the big, 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 big monolithic companies, uh, Amway, Herbalife, Mary Kay, Avon, the, the, you know, some of the top 10 network marketing companies in the history of the world were all built based on giving people a tangible experience with the product so that they can taste it, feel it, touch it, smell it, like it, and then purchase it if they want. Wanted to, and then it's a lot easier than to go to those people who have tasted and liked the product and say, "Hey, you want to join the opportunity now? Is there is an opportunity if you'd like to? Great, let's get rolling, let's get moving." So, folks, those are the four steps to get started. Number one, step one: get the website from your friend, enter your personal information, make sure you have that credit card handy uh, so that you can get everything taken care of. Step two: choose your Jumpstart pack. I always recommend the Big League pack because it gives you one of every single one of our products so that you can have a tangible experience. Step number three: choose the choose the auto ship, the product that you would like to coming have uh, coming to your house every 28 days, like clockwork. And then step number four: have your first tasting experience so we can get a little bit of money back in your pocket so that you can start uh, moving about and moving towards that goal of stepping into a greater measure of the purpose for which you're wanting to do this business in the first place. So with that, folks, that's what we're doing. Those are the four steps to get started. Um, welcome aboard the team. Congratulations for taking a step out of your, you know, you know, your busy evening schedule to come on board with us. Uh, we're rocking and rolling. We personally just got done with a meeting of 15 to 20 brand new people that have flown out from all of the all places. Are, I mean, we got people here from Tennessee. We've got people here from Florida, California. We got people from all over the place that came in to our office today and spent the whole entire day with us uh, just to learn more about. And they're rocking and ready and rolling, rolling to go. Matter of fact, um, quite a few of them. Four of them are already, they've only been around the company for a week, two weeks, and they're already into the top four, top five for the Fiat competition. So again, congratulations goes out to uh, Gianna and Matt and Dino, out to Gabe, Brett Summers, uh, Kim Hawk, Susan Bonner, um, Victoria Gianna, Vincent Perez, Lena Corn, Jeff, and Stars and Stripes for being in the top ten positions of our Fiat competition. Folks, have a beautiful evening. Have a wonderful weekend. Go out and give someone an awesome day tomorrow. Go out and smile to your neighbors. Say hi to them every once in a while. Be social, be loved, be more, do more, have more, give more, and I'll talk to you next Tuesday night at 6 o'clock Pacific time. Have a good weekend, folks. Bye-bye.